darn it, there was a raccoon right there. There was a little raccoon right there, and he came out, he was looking at the squirrels. But then he saw me, and he moved off into that hole. He's got a little, he must live inside of that right there. Some squirrels were playing. Wow, I didn't even know this was back here. A neighbor recommended this arboretum. There's a ravine up here, it says, and a loop. A talia loop. Darn. Cool looking raccoon, too. He had like really white fur, the white sections of him. And he went into that. That, like, whatever, the bundle of pine needles and leaves there where that tree's leaning over. Ah, that was cool. see a raccoon out during the day. I think, ooh, is that an armadillo? All sorts of stuff moving around down there. There's Bigfoot. <laughs> you can hear the scurrying of animals all in there. This is like walking through a prehistoric Florida here. This is December, by the way, mid-December. <laughs> Everyone's like buried in snow in a blizzard. <laughs> and we're walking a nature trail and with a tank top on. <laughs> this is crazy. Sparkleberry Exidium Arboreum. Somewhere back here is a is a ravine, is what the sign said. Whoa. I'm like on high alert. It's warm enough for snakes to be out in December. My senses are like, oh, my spidey senses are tingling. <laughs> There's stuff all in this brush here. Community of squirrels here. Oh, this is an awesome thing. 